Hi from La Palme. Oshin is here at the La Palme Speed Challenge for windsurfing. Oshin, how, why are you here and how do you get fast? Uh, to, to go really fast on a windsurfer, you need to have really strong wind, like 50 knots of wind, both for 10, 11, but also very flat water so that you can keep the board in control. And at La Palme, at the Salin, at the lake, there is a, a bank that we go very close to that keeps the water very flat. And when the wind is strong from the Tramontana from the north, then we get the perfect conditions. And that's why we're here waiting for the perfect conditions. So even if, if it, it, it feels windy and it feels warm, but it's not the perfect condition. So what do you do if you are not training or uh, competing? Uh, so, some, some sightseeing, also because I'm in France, it's beautiful, but... Um, There is wind from different directions during these days, so we, we practice, we make training, we just, yeah, windsurf as much as possible. Every time you go more is, is more more knowledge, more practice, um, staying fit, being in, this, in the water, it's, yeah, okay. it's nice. How important is technique for windsurfing? Uh, technique, of course, you have to learn what works, what doesn't work. Um, But more than that, you see, we have a lot of equipment, uh, all different size boards and sails uh, for different conditions. So learning the technique uh, is one thing. Also knowing what equipment to use for the conditions is another thing. And, and with that knowledge, then is um, you have the information then to know what, what equipment to use and when and, and how, how to improve. So you're really experienced, so you know, I think, uh, what you have to take. But how did you learn it? Like, did you read a lot of books uh, or the internet? Or? No, I think just practice. I, I windsurf now 30 years. So from learning, I can look at the sea and I know what the wind is straight away and I know what sail I need to take from the car, what board, what will work, what won't work. Um, a lot of it is, is gaining the information first and then and being able to take advantage of that to, to give you the result at the end. Okay, thank you. So how fast do you want to be at the speed contest? Um, my challenge is to break 50 knots. Um, and uh, for a number of years, I'm at almost 48. So it's, it's very close. But when you get to these speeds, like every one knot becomes more difficult to achieve. So I'm still chasing. So I'm, I'm chasing the perfect conditions, really. That's what I need. So I hope this will come here. Okay, so thank you and good luck. Thank you.